feels good, just knowing that you're doing something dangerous. And it's really an adrenaline rush. I love the freedom of it. I love being able to turn where I want to turn, and I love being able to stop when I want to stop. Everything's quiet. You don't really think about anything. Um, just get really relaxed. That's really it. And my mind is completely blank. I'm not thinking about anything else. So it's really relaxing and it just clears up my mind. Like if I'm like stressed out about something other than longboarding, it just goes away. Especially like when you slide or something, you feel like you're just floating there. And going really fast, it's almost the same thing. You're just floating right above the pavement. And every move you make, you and your body, like is affecting everything that's happening. friends just saw a couple of videos on YouTube of these kids just bombing hills and we were like damn that looks really sick. We used to ride around his uh, neighborhood and we used to ride down hills and that was probably the first time. The first time I rode a longboard was just in my driveway. A pretty decent driveway for like people just learning so it was pretty big to me and once I conquered my driveway I just moved out onto like local roads. When it's just you and really just a piece of bamboo probably and some wheels. It's a totally different experience. I used to skateboard and uh, you have uh, bigger, softer wheels on the longboard so like I was just cruising forever and it was just such a great feeling like never felt anything like it. It's an adrenaline rush, you know, it's really exciting. The wind's in your face. It's as soon as I step on that board and I'm going down a hill, I'm like, this is real. Like, I'm either done or else I'm gonna stick with it and I'm gonna finish this hill. I mean, it might not, it might not happen every run, but say you're going down a run and um, you do something where you almost fall, like right in that second if you save it or if you fall, you just, time just stops. It's a really dangerous sport just because if you, if you overestimate your abilities or whatever it is, you go down a too steep hill, something happens, a lot of times it's not even in your control, you could really get hurt. There's no place to really ride a longboard. Um, like, you go to like Vermont, you could go down like ski down mountains and stuff, but for us, we ride down public roads. Cars, pavement, um, hitting rocks, debris of any sort. Going fast, I mean, everything's dangerous about it, pretty much. I've seen kids hit trees going like 30 miles an hour. When does my friend almost die? And this kid just went face first, right into this fucking like black Camaro car that was inside the garage and he hit a guardrail. He was probably going close to 30 miles an hour. So literally, I basically got close. A friend of mine, actually, who uh, fell going a little too fast, and he almost died. I saw Victor, too, uh, crash into a mailbox, and uh, I guess he fucked up his spine, and now he's paralyzed. Well, 
after I fall, I'm like, wow, I need to finish this hill or else I'm gonna feel bad about myself. Just like, once I start something, I gotta finish it. The more I think about it, less I wanna get on the board, so. If you mess up on something, and you're just like, oh my God, how'd that happen, blah, blah, and, I, and it, it'll bother you. It'll be like, why did that happen? How can I improve myself? It's like practice, same thing with anything else. The only way you're gonna get better at it is if you keep doing it. So longboarding is just, it's just so easy. Yeah, like if you like baseball and you wanna play a game, I mean, that takes, what, 20 people? The longboarding, it's just you and a friend, and you could have an amazing time, you know? You get outdoors, some sunshine, you get great views, you got adrenaline rush, I mean, there's so many good things that can come of it. It's a really just kind of great experience all around. When you're cruising along and it's a nice, beautiful day, and it's not too hot, it has a little breeze, and sometimes if you, whether you're alone or you're with a buddy, it's just, calming and relaxed it's like it's like its own high in itself i don't know you kind of like forget about just like stressful stuff in your life you don't really like think about like what you're gonna do next in your day or like what you're gonna do tomorrow or anything just like kind of live in the moment very very relaxing riding down the hill <laughs> you can't really get that anywhere else like it's just different